Some rumors are stirring for Call of Duty Black Ops 6 Zombies. Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Call of Duty Black Ops 6 continues to have leaks and rumors circulating around this game. Today I wanted to cover the zombies aspect of these leaks and rumors, so let's get into it. We know for sure that classic round based zombies is returning with Call of Duty Black Ops 6, but we are unsure of how many round based zombies maps will be available at launch of Call of Duty Black Ops 6. With current rumors and storyline elements hinting at two round-based maps being available at launch, and these maps are codenamed ZM underscore Court, and ZM underscore Garnet, and both maps being set within the 1990s. ZM underscore Garnet is rumored to take place within a town and or city and includes details such as a bank, a church, and a police station, and is rumored to include zip lines like those included in Mauer der Toten. The town that this map is based in is called Liberty Falls. This isn't the map name itself, it's just the name of the town this map will be based in. ZM underscore Quartz, which currently the community has deemed this map Terminus Island, as this map is rumored to take place on an island with an elevator which will take you to an underground prison and lab. This map also includes a ship deck cannon trap, which you can activate and change the trajectory of. For gameplay details that we know so far, we got the return of the mystery box, the pack-a-punch machine, large ammo boxes, and the return of the arsenal system from Black Ops Cold War where you can upgrade your armor and such. However, you won't be able to increase your weapon's rarity here anymore. Leakers have discovered a new crafting table strictly dedicated to upgrading your weapon's rarity and such. Leakers have also found references to a gobblegum-like system that could return within Black Ops 6 Zombies. The X-Fail option is returning from Cold War Zombies. A new tentacle dog is rumored to be coming within Black Ops 6 Zombies along with the return of the Mangler. We know that the Ray Gun and the Jet Gun are returning as these two wonder weapons have been found in game files in regards to Black Ops 6. There are also references to the Wonder Wolf DG2 and references to a weapon that causes a bubbling effect that spreads to zombies, similar to the KT-4 from Zetsubo Noshima. In conclusion, all of these rumors surrounding Call of Duty Black Ops 6 Zombies has me super excited to play some round based zombies again, and I really hope that Treyarch is able to deliver an incredible experience for us. I have full faith that they will, because they've had four years to develop this game, and four years to polish the maps that they've created for zombies, and I'm really excited to see what kind of new wonder weapons that they're gonna bring for us this year. What kind of new perks are they gonna deliver for us this year? What kind of new ways of playing zombies are they gonna deliver this year? I've also heard rumors that Outbreak. Break 2.0 is supposed to be coming out, which is a complete evolution to what we've had in years prior with Outbreak. I'm super excited to play some zombies again, and Treyarch, bring it on. Thank you all so much for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, smash the like button and consider subscribing to stay up to date with all the latest content, and share the channel with your friends. It helps the channel grow. Have a great day, everyone.